It's the Daily Special with Kimberly Bray Miller. Welcome to the Daily Special. It's Wednesday, June 11th, and uh, later on today we've got a boot camp workout to kick your booty. But first, I've got some sad news, but you know, it's important news. Apparently one in four New Yorkers have herpes, genital herpes. And reportedly, apparently, our aid statistics in this country are off by 25%. They're actually 25% more new cases per year than originally thought. Which makes me think that sex is like the most scariest thing in the entire world. Nobody should be having sex. If you're having sex, stop. No matter, I mean, because you can, you can never really trust your spouse or your monogamous partner or that guy you met at a bar. So just, I think sex really should just be stopped completely at this point, just so you know. Um, and this is really sad, it's really sad news, um, but I actually, I think there's a bit of a conspiracy theory going on in my mind because I think all of these things, these rumors, these scientific studies are really a bunch of scientists who haven't gotten laid in a while making stuff up because they don't want anyone else to have sex either. <laughs> they're lonely. You know, you could call me, we could be friends. All right, let's go to the specials. Robert Downey Jr. credits Burger King with getting him off drugs. Apparently on a mission to get drugs from his dealer, he stopped at Burger King, had a burger, and afterward he had such a bad feeling in his stomach that he just decided that drugs were not for him. For most of us, that would mean it was time for an emodium, but hey, whatever works. <laughs> The artist formerly known as Puff Daddy is becoming Puff Daddy again, and yet still no one cares. <laughs> A recent study shows that more and more Americans are having sleepless nights due to worries about the lagging economy. I say, if you're not sleeping anyway, you might as well pick up a night shift. <laughs> For summer, well, I guess not to start because summer's here, but hey, you know, whenever really. Um, so we've got Stacy from Stacy's Bootcamp to teach us how to do things without a gym, on our own, in a park, in a hotel, in your bathroom, whatever. Stacy, show me the way. Hey Kim, welcome to my office, Central Park, New York City. This is one of the spots, Bethesda Fountain in Central Park, where I usually do my boot camp class. I started as a trainer, and I watched the cycle of people come to the gym and not really do the right movements and not see any changes in their bodies. So I thought, I think there's a much better way to do this, and so I decided, let's take the workout outside where we use only the environment and our bodies as the weights. Okay, so the first exercise we're gonna start with is a reverse lunge. So you always wanna make sure the shoulders are right above the waist as you step together, and you do that by focusing on keeping your stomach tight. So you don't wanna come forward like that. If you see, my knee is way over my toe, and that's bringing a lot of pressure on the knee. The next one we're gonna go into is a squat thrust. It's gonna elevate the heart rate as well as work your core, your lower back, your obliques, legs a little bit, and upper body a little bit. So slowly, here, throwing the legs back so that you're in a full push-up position. Here, make sure your hips are flat, your shoulders, your hips, and your ankles should be in a straight line. Then you're gonna jump your legs forward and then stand up again. The next exercise we're gonna do is a push-up. Push-up is gonna work the chest, shoulders, and triceps, but you have to think of it as a total body exercise because you're gonna have to hold your body in the plank position. You gotta keep your legs tight, your butt tight, your stomach tight, everything. So really, it's a great total body exercise. The next exercise that we're gonna do is a jackknife. It's gonna work the upper and the lower part of the stomach. It's a leg lift and a crunch at the same time. You're exhaling on the way up, inhaling on the way down. Thanks for coming out today. You got a few of the exercises, but if you ever want to learn any more, please come to Stacy's Bootcamp or visit my website at stacysbootcamp.com. I am off to my next class. Bye. Yeah.